she was always involved in the community, so this would have been right up her alley. Um, she would have been the first person in line to be at this event. Jordan Buff was Morgan Sigler's longtime friend and college roommate. Because of her major in restaurant and hospitality management, Jordan had the opportunity to schedule an art class to honor the friend she lost in the April 27th tornado. And I thought what better way to use, utilize some supplies that we had in the Ferguson Center that were left over and do an art event for her, um, for her family fund, the Morgan Sigler Memorial Fund. Seventy of Morgan's classmates and friends showed up to paint with a purpose, an activity that would have been close to Morgan's heart. Because she's so virtuous, I decided to use the lily, which has long been a symbol of female virtue and purity and spirit. And I thought that was a fitting kind of symbol for her. Caleb O'Connor didn't know Morgan, but he knew he wanted to use his mm. skills to help honor her. And I wanted to do something that was specifically about Morgan. Now, I don't know Morgan, but I did and was able to speak did to people that did know her. And what I heard was that she was a remarkable young woman who was interested in helping other people. Morgan's parents attended the event to support the students in their efforts to help the memorial fund set up in their daughter's honor. They talked with classmates and friends from the art department about how they are going to keep Morgan's memory alive. They're going to do um, art supplies and they're sending them on mission trips and that kind of thing to kids in foreign countries and kids around the world that are underprivileged. So there, it supplies art supplies since she was an art student. For the University of Alabama, I'm Rebecca Waldrop reporting.